what's going on everybody welcome back to another video um in today's video i will be discussing some important information as well as showing you all what's behind this and up there and all sorts of stuff so if you guys are hyped don't forget to drop a like subscribe hit that notification bell my name's obscured ghost and let's get started okay so um so let's go ahead and start with this. One, let me flip my camera. All right. So let's go ahead and talk about this. So um, here we got our gaming. Here we got our gaming chair. You can no longer get it. I got this for like hundred and forty bucks on Amazon last year. I mean, it's pretty nice. There are much cheaper ones now and probably better off, but. Um, super comfy, I like it, and, um, yeah, it's pretty nice. Alright, so now, this desk, this desk, right here, um, this is a tempered glass Edison Walker desk. You can get this for, like, two, maybe, a hundred, hundred and fifty, like, two hundred bucks on Amazon. Um, it's pretty nice, and then, uh, it is made out of tempered glass, so, um, yeah. It's made out of tempered glass. Not sure if you can see it or not. And it's also see-through. I'm not I'm not necessarily sure if y'all can see my hand under there or not. But um yeah. It is pretty nice. So right here I have a um four terabyte hard drive. Um right now since my um right now by the time you guys see this com uh video, this will not be here, so um but this basically is my computer. Um, right now I'm currently transferring files onto this. So that way when this comes back all nice and clean and new and stuff. I have all my files on here. That way I don't lose anything. Um, this is a 4 terabyte flash drive. Dash hard drive. You get it for like maybe 130 bucks at Best Buy or whatever. That's of course what I did, but um, yeah, it's a uh, four terabyte. And then right here, this main computer, this is a Dell G5. This is a Dell G5 GeForce Nevada 1660 Ti GTX, of course, Intel Core i9, and um, the best computer I ever owned. Except for that I have to get it replaced. Um, it has all nice LED keys. And has everything you need on it ready to go. Under here. This is a Steel. This is a Steel Series Apex 100 Elite. You get this for like 45-50 bucks at like a Walmart or Best Buy or Amazon or whatever. Um, keys are... Keys are blue, as you can see. Has all nice, doesn't do any effects. Sadly, it's only one color, but it definitely does work the best. And I do recommend it. And then, right here, I have my I have a Razor Basilisk Elite version 2. So that's this. That's my gaming mouse right here. With a wired extension cord, of course. A um, rubber band around it and and then plugged into my computer and then of course Razer obviously I bought this like two years ago best best mouse I ever owned and um yeah and my mouse pad we will not talk about that this mouse I don't know where I got it from sorry but this mouse goes to my second monitor which is right here which I'm which unfortunately I gotta take apart and uh, put the and put down connected. But while I'm streaming or, or whatever, um, I can that I can tell you guys that um this does come in helpful because I'll ha I'll be playing my game right here, and then over here I'll be like streaming and doing. And watching the live chat, watching my video feed, whatever, whatever y'all need. 
and then um yeah right here i have a blue yeti stand which um this is used for my blue yeti unfortunately it's off the stand right now but um yes now let's show you guys that all right so before we get to the blue yeti i just want to say this mic arm this is a toner t20 i did an unboxing video on that you guys can look it up but this is mic arm um it comes with a base right there very sturdy best best one i owned and then it's nice because i can have the wire it comes with velcro straps comes with its own windscreen and pop filter and then well if you want to see everything just go to my unboxing video there and then um i run the blue yeti cord from here up to down here to right here and and enter the shock mount so now let's talk about the shock mount so the shock mount is a you know is an in a gear knlx shock mount um it's supposed to reduce the quality definitely recommend it i got this for like maybe 15 bucks on amazon pretty cheap if you ask me and then um of course we got my blue yeti now unfortunately it's not plugged in but um yes and to prove it is a blue yeti of course you got your microphone right there um the blue logo your volume adjustment push it in to mute it push it out and since it's not on otherwise the circle will light green or red red means it's muted green means it's on and then in the back which is which right here not sure if y'all can see it or not but right here i have its gain or opacity so like this circle right so like focus camera but this circle yes okay So, um, this right here, it has a full circle but a line through it. That means it's only getting what's in front of the mic. But this where it's just a entire open circle, um, it means it's getting your surround sound or whatever. So, if I'm, like, away from the mic and all I have to do is switch this mode and just talk and it'll gain it. But if I'm on this mode right here then I hit them whatever's in front of this as long as this is a foot away it'll still get good connection but yeah um now let's talk about these and then I have the windscreen so like well you know looks professional that way and um yeah so here I have my Xbox Xbox One controller, all white. That's nice. And then here I have a Xbox Three, and then here I have an Xbox Three Hundred and Sixty Gears of War controller, cause cause it's nice and it's Gears of War. If you never played the game, test it out it's a good game you won't recommend you won't regret it and then my xbox one right here and then behind here uh focus actually hold on actually hold on so this remote but whatever on the snap of my on the snap of my finger these shall turn off one two three and so they are off <laughs> so these are off um these two are led side bars from tozumi led light bars um they're multiple colors here's the switch you combine them they're both connected into my xbox which are nice and then and then if i'm having and then i'll usually have these on like the strobe or smooth mode or whatever which is nice and then it gives me that all nice white glare which is pretty cool
and then my fan because it gets hot in here whatever i don't know where the fan's from but yeah and then then and then Mac not connected to anything. And then down there, I have a small Mountain Dew mini fridge, which is nice. And then in the back, in the back, I have some collectible from an event. In the back row, I have Star. In the back row, I have Avengers. And then in front, I have your Star Wars. And then here I have a, and then my headphones, I use a Razer, I use a Razer Kraken X. I'm very comfy. You could get this for like 50 bucks on Amazon or Walmart or wherever you go. And then there's a bunch of used Robux codes um, here. You can see the pile of them. But, um, yeah, they are definitely huge. And, um, back here you got a lamp. And then, let's talk about up here. So, so up here I have the Razor Kraken X box. The Yeti I use. Um, something I gotta do later on. Um, my gaming mouse, which is, as you can see, Razor Basilisk. Um, R2-D2 drone. You can't get that no more. And then a, um, and then Funko Pop from Spirit Halloween, Hocus Pocus. Um, I want to try to collect more Funko Pops in the future, but, um, these are nice. Second, I have a Day of the Dead Skull, which, which basically means that, like, for the, it basically says, um, it, Day of the Dead, like, it's a Mexican holiday. It's a Mexican holiday. Um, lasts from November first to November second. Um, it's pretty cool. And then, um, here I have a freedom. Um, I have a freedom flag thing with an eagle and representing your saint or whatever symbol. And then a uh. And then my phone case, custom painting in the back. Thank you for that fan art. Whoever drew that, thank you. And then another phone case. And then another phone case right there. And then some loose papers. And then in the back, you got your LED lights, your shock mount, my, uh, my microphone arm arm. And then I got a Fortnite drift mask right there. And then in the back I have a striker drone. So, so but the drone's huge, yes. Because yes. And then um, right here I got my Pink Floyd. I, I painted this and it's pretty cool. And I painted this a while back. And, um... It's black lighted, so it's nice. And then, and then sound, and then curtains to keep the sound off and stuff. And then, and then, yeah, my gaming chair, of course. Oh, and then, of course, obscured IRL merch right here. I'm just kidding, guys. It's a black samurai hat, custom painted. Like, I basically just spray painted it. Because it was like a brownish tan. Because it was like a tannish. So you could still see some paint in it. But I got to redo one more coat on it. But um, yeah. I'll wear this during like streams or whatever. And um, it's pretty cool. So um, yeah. So guys. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video. Um. Don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. My name's Obscured Ghost, and remember, I won't be live streaming or um, making videos for a long time because of my computer issues, and I have to get a new one and stuff. But um, yeah, so I'm hoping to end this with a banger. So um, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. My name's Obscured Ghost, and um, I'll see you guys. Whenever I get my new stuff, peace out and enjoy the video.